On the DJI Mini 4 Pro, there are a number of major improvements compared to the Mini 3 Pro. They look very similar. The first one relates to the collision avoidance sensors. They're now fisheye sensors and they're aiming at 45 degrees and the front sensors and the side sensors and the back sensors. So that you're getting a complete 360 degree collision avoidance now rather than the front and the back only, which was on the Mini 3 Pro. It looks very similar to the Mini 3 Pro, but these are a major improvement. They also give you 360 degree tracking, which we'll go and have a look at in another video. These four fisheye lenses are actually cameras, black and white cameras, and it's called Vision Assist. And we can look through these cameras using the software and see what they're seeing. But what they do is they work in conjunction with the camera to form the basis of the 360 degree tracking. We're now looking at the drone controller screen. On the bottom left, there are three options that you can pull up by swiping right. There's the second option and here's the third option. And this is the black and white cameras from Vision Assist. We're now looking at the front camera and you can now, I'm gonna to move to the rear camera and now I've moved to the left camera and now I've moved to the right camera. It's showing the, on the arrows in yellow. By clicking on the screen, I can make the black and white picture the larger one and the major one. And by looking at that, you can start to see where the yellow arrows are. And we're now looking to the rear. You can start to see the props in the picture as well. We're now looking to the right. Now to the front. And I click on to the left as well. We just click on the yellow arrow and it moves around and it's showing us the black and white view through the fisheye lenses and now we're back now we're back on the main screen view here's me at another location with vision assist and we're looking at the diff four different sides of the drone i'll make the black and white picture the large one in a minute expand it there and you can see the props in the black and white photos. We're flipping between the four different sides. That's back at the front, you can see the car park. The 360 degree views from Vision Assist are not much use on their own, but here are two things you can use them for. When you're close to an object up between 2.5 and five meters away, you'll get this yellow glow. You can see there, because it's close to me and this yellow glow or pulsing will become red at two meters away from the object. The second useful thing you can do with Vision Assist is to hold the arrow down for three seconds and it will lock on that particular direction. If you don't press this, the default will return to the direction the drone is flying after three seconds. In conclusion, the four fisheye lenses gives you 360 degree collision avoidance and when they combine with the camera, that gives you 360 degree tracking. So the vision assist should now start to make sense. Happy flying. If you enjoyed this video, then subscribe to the channel or watch the next video in the playlist or the new videos that we've just recently downloaded. Bye for now.